hungry lion roars and wolf howls the moon, whilst the heavy plowman snores, all with weary tasks were done. Now the wasted brands do glow, but the screech owl screeching loud puts the wretch that lies in woe in remembrance of a shroud. Now is the time of night, with the graves all gaping wide. Everyone lets forth their fairy sprite, and the church way paths to glide. And we, the fairies that do run by the triple Hecate's team, from the presence of the sun, following darkness like a dream, now are frolic. Not a mouse shall disturb this hallowed house. I am sent with broom before to sweep the dust behind the door. Until the break of day, through this house each fairy stray, to the best bright bed shall we, which by us shall blessed be. And the issue there create ever shall be fortunate. So shall all the couples three ever true and loving be. And the blots of nature's hand shall not in their issue stand. Never mole, hair lip, nor scar, nor mark prodigious such as are despised in nativity shall upon their children be. With this field do consecrate, every fairy take his gate, and each several chamber bless through this palace with sweet peace. And the owner of it bless ever shall in safety rest. Trip away, make no stay, meet me all by the break of day. Offended? Think but this, and all is amended, that you have but slumbered here, while these visions did appear. And this weak and idle theme, no more you, but a dream. Gentles, do not reprehend. If you pardon, we will mend. And as I am an honest puck, if we have an earned luck now to escape the serpent's tongue, we will make amends ere long. Else the puck a liar call. So, good night unto you all. Give me your hands if we can. 